developments now in the case of a 73-year-old man shot during a carjacking in Mobile. Mobile police have arrested a suspect in the last hour. He's 18-year-old Daryl Campbell. He's charged with robbery and assault. A juvenile suspect was also arrested and charged with attempting to elude police and theft. News 5's Mary Smith joins us now live from police headquarters. Mary, have they escorted those suspects to jail yet? Yeah, Peter, I just had a chance to speak to both the 18-year-old and 17-year-old suspects here just moments ago. They're both being transported to Mobile Metro Jail. That 18-year-old Daryl Campbell is actually out on bond from a theft charge. He is facing an assault charge for allegedly shooting uh, the 73-year-old in the abdomen. And actually, when we brought him out here just a few minutes ago, he did admit to us that he committed that crime. They also arrested a 17-year-old named Justin Lambert. Uh, he's charged with receiving stolen property. He's not accused of shooting that 73 year old but he is being charged as an adult so police say that it's okay for us to show video of him and interview him in this case again that's 17 year old Justin Lambert and an 18 year old Daryl Campbell now they do tell me that that victim in this case the 73 year old is in critical yet stable condition it's business as usual on Robinson Drive Thursday after a man is shot Wednesday night. Like I said, it's a quiet neighborhood. No nothing really be going, you know, go on around, around that way. Mobile police say the 73-year-old was shot, then his truck stolen. It was a shock to me, you know, because I didn't know what was going on. When I pulled up, I'm looking at him on the ground. He pouring out blood, so he was shot already. Miles lives by the victim on the 2100 block of Robinson Drive. He came home after his neighbor was shot in the abdomen. He was uh, alert well enough to talk to the officers or whatever. Um, they helped him up but just a little bit to get on the scratcher. Another neighbor lives on the block with his elderly mom right next door to kids who say they saw it all happen. It's shocking, you know what I'm saying, because you never, you know, you never know what, what's going to happen, but you know, you, you, you know, this, it hit close to home, you know, so that is a concern. And police say that they have recovered the victim's 2008 Jeep, which was stolen yesterday on the 2100 block of Robinson Drive. Reporting live at police headquarters, Mary Smith, WKRG News 5, local coverage you can count on.